We are beginning with a suspected child predator, a man claiming to be a City of Houston employee who was caught on the web. And we've learned that a group of Internet watchdogs helped police make the arrest. The suspect was taken into custody at his home in the 3500 block of Camp Field Road. 11 News reporter Jeff McShann shows us the evidence and who helped police get it. Tuesday afternoon, 11 News was there when 55-year-old Thomas Randall Jennings was arrested and charged with solicitation of a minor. He was arrested at his home in Katy and is being held in the Harris County Jail on $30,000 bond. Harris County tells 11 News to learn why Jennings was arrested, all we had to do was check out this website, pervertedjustice.com, a website started by a man calling himself Xavier Von Erk who says he wants to protect children. What we do is we go into chat rooms posing as 10 to 15 year old males or females, uh, and we just sit. And in this case, Jennings hit on one of our profiles that was of a 12 year old female. The U.S. Attorney's Office estimates that one in five kids aged 10 to 17 receive an internet sexual solicitation. Many fear law enforcement cannot keep up. So Von Erk says, his 3,000 volunteers are trying to help. When they find what they believe to be an online predator, they call police. And we get a hold of some really, some really great law enforcement. In this case, uh, the James case, we got a hold of some really great law enforcement in Harris County, and, and now they're the only one. On the website, the entire month-long cyber chat that allegedly involved Jennings is logged. Here are just a few excerpts that we can show you. The suspect allegedly Jennings types, it's 116 here and I need to get up in four hours to go to work. The volunteer acting as a 12 year old girl replies, it's two here, what kind of work do you do? The suspect for the city of Houston, volunteer, wow that sounds important. The suspect, love you, volunteer, love you too. Suspect says, good night, volunteer, good night, have a good Monday. The suspect replies, I will dream of you tonight. The citizen volunteer says, ah, me too. Jennings is spending this night in the Harris County Jail. Well, there have been many complaints about pervertedjustice.com. Basically say they're involved in entrapment. But when talking with its leader today, they said those entrapment uh, complaints are no longer valid because the website itself has resulted in the 41 convictions in 23 states nationwide. Now, we want to tell you just a few minutes ago, we talked with Houston attorney Don Becker, who sent me this email via the BlackBerry tonight. He says he is representing Mr. Thomas. He says he was arrested today as a result of false and defamatory information provided by a private vigilante group located in the northwest part of our country. Our investigation of Mr. Jennings' situation has revealed that the time he was allegedly chatting with the alleged 12-year-old female, he was out of town. We will keep you posted, Mr. Jennings. Thomas Jennings is due in court on Thursday. We're live downtown. Jeff McShann, 11 News.